Well, today's not as nice as it's been. We're looking at putting the tracks on that 1150. Um, yeah, it's a little drippy, rainy, chilly. Not quite freezing, but it's uh, mid-30s. So we're gonna give it a shot anyway, right, Con? Yep. All right, we gotta put air in our backhoe tire because that's what we do. <laughs> we always have a flat somewhere. Dozer's gotta go back as far as it'll go, huh? You know what that means. Fuel's off. We're idiots.
Oh, okay. I put it in the freezer. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we got to cut another pin. This is a slightly smaller diameter than the original pins, but we just want to be able to throw it in there so we can move the machine. Um, I don't imagine they're going to stay in there so great, but just enough to get the machine over to where we can work on it a little easier, get it up out of the muck. That's the big thing. There's the original pin. Kind of just, you can make it a hair longer. Maybe less chance of it falling out. Now we're just going to cut this pin. You want to try the bandsaw? Yeah. It's solid bar, but I think this will cut that easier. Quite a tool. What about lubricants? What do you want to use for lube? Cutting tool coolant. It's probably not oil. Shit, break clean. <laughs> <laughs> Seems it, doesn't it? Yeah. There, ain't ya? There we go. I got another pen. Okay, back out in the rain. It's a terrible day today. Can't believe you picked. Yeah, but yesterday was so nice. Yeah, that was yesterday. Well, Today's a whole different day. I figure we're breaking even. <laughs> okay. It's all wet. Oh, so is my camera. like we're uh, you know we got tracks on it we got her together it does move a little <laughs> <laughs> that one tracks back about what how much further than the other one Probably all the grease off. pumped out well I'd like to know how long it takes before it does reset well you want to just fire it right back up you think it would reset it back I don't know I don't know either 
I say give it 10 minutes. Okay. All right, we're going inside. It's not fit for ducks out here. Looks like we're back in the book. Low oil pressure, possible causes. Worn out oil seal ring and O-rings, check. Worn out old pump, check. Or relief valve open. We're hoping it's the relief valve is sticking open. Yeah, right? and I think that's what it is. Because when the shaft isn't moving, it, it's dumping uh, fluid out of the seal, which is where the relief valve dumps to, we, we think. Around that yoke, there's a seal. That relief valve's right there. It dumps into that housing there. Yeah, it's kind of a long shot, though, that the relief pops back and then resets itself. You know, it just slips back where it belongs. Spring-loaded. Yeah, I know, but... I think there's rust in there. It's acting like a detent. So pressure builds, pushes against the spring. The rust catches it. So it's got the spring pressure working against the hydraulic pressure and that little bit of rust that is just just enough to hold it from that breakaway. Well, that's a way better story than the whole thing's wore out. <laughs> well, <laughs> there's that too. Uh, uh, yeah. Let's, let's face it, this is junk. We are playing with junk. Well, yeah. So there's the spring, relief valve spring. And you already took the spring out. I took it out. It looked, I, it looked clean in there, I right? I put a bunch of PV blaster in there. Okay. Well, that's a pretty short section of the book. Yeah, well, it's only about the drive. Why would that be a long section? Oh, there's the thing. I know, it's got all, but it doesn't mention it in this. Transmission pressure regulator, torque converter pressure regulator. Ooh, there's pressure a torque, con there's a torque converter pressure regulator. Where's that? Oh, that's that, that, that's that guy there, okay. I bet you that could be our issue. That could be it too, couldn't when it? That bypasses, when that bypasses, it goes to the oil cooler. Oh yeah? Yeah, that's what I read. I, I like this book, it's got pictures. It's even got cartoons. Yeah, that's a quality cartoon. Look at that guy. Yeah, he look looks like he's he, about to storm Normandy or he's something. Having a, <laughs> he's having a great time on that machine. The sun has started moving again. Well, I think you're going to run out of the tracks, or as loose as they can be. It, it shoves the adjusters all the way back. we got to get grease fittings. So there was just some kind of goofy something going on. I don't know. I bet it quits again. There's some si again. something we systemically stupid going on. Around, it'll start working again. You gotta back it up so the pins are on the sprocket. Okay. Where we can get to both sides of the pin.